Here's my experimental setup. I have the two familiar coils here. I have a little panel of uh, 40 super bright white LEDs here. I have a oscilloscope hooked uh, up or near the proximity of the large coil. And I have my signal generator feeding the primary, feeding the entire system. Uh, according to my theory, um, as we move the pickup coil closer to proximity of the transmitter coil, we should pick up a larger signal, uh, increasing the output on the LEDs, but at the same time causing more of a load to be drawn from the larger transmitter coil. So what we should find is as I move this coil closer, the signal picked up by the, this coil right here will increase, yet uh, on the oscilloscope we'll see the standing wave voltage ratio decrease, uh, indicating increased coupling between the coils. Um, if my theory is correct, there should be a nice spot right around the second radius where the signal uh, transmitted from here to here is at its greatest point for the uh, coupling back to the coil creating an optimum ring or a, a preferred transmission uh, radius around this larger coil. And uh, that should um, equate to the most efficient operation possible with this current setup. Here you can see the receiver coil and the transmitter coil have quite a bit of distance between them meaning minimal coupling. At the same time because of minimal coupling we have minimal back coupling uh, causing minimal drain on the transmitter coil. Because of this we have a rather high Q and a rather high standing wave ratio as you can see by the peak to peak voltage here on my oscilloscope. Uh, as I move the coil extremely close to it what you'll find after a bit of retuning is that we have very high LED intensity here on our little 40 bank of LEDs, but our standing wave ratio peak to peak voltage has dropped significantly, meaning that there is large back coupling between the receiver and the transmitter, meaning more energy is being drawn from the source. Uh, if I'm correct though, we should be able to, uh, this is our previous standing wave ratio voltage, and uh, there should be an optimal point here, right about there at the second radius around this coil, that is a good um, compromise between standing wave ratio and the uh, signal picked up. As you can see we have dropped a little bit off of our uh, off of our back coupling there and our standing wave ratio has decreased a little bit but we also have a bright bank of LEDs right there so this uh, kind of equates to the two graphs intersecting at one common point of most efficiency and uh, if this experimental uh, setup is any proof, I believe that the theory is so far correct.